Hey everybody, Corey with Liquidert here, and I just want to touch base with you, talk to you a little bit about Liquidert. Uh, Liquidert is a pretty incredible product. We've been working on that for about 30 years. What makes Liquidert so incredible is we have 18 ingredients that we mine, harvest, and grow. And in those 18 ingredients, we actually biodigest those through a 40-stage, five-year process. That breaks them down into the absolute raw ingredients. What makes that so critical is that makes it so that the plants can absorb those at a cellular level. When you have nutrients that plants can absorb at a cellular level, it goes into their root systems and into their leaf systems, their stalks, their stems, every part of the plant. And it doesn't matter if the plant is healthy or not healthy, liquid earth can fix that plant. And it does that because of how simple it is to use and how simple it is to apply to your plants. And it's about as easy as making a cup of coffee. So a little bit of cream, a little bit of sugar, a little bit of thyme, mix it up, we're good to go. Now let me show you how easy it is to mix liquid art, because if you think making a cup of coffee is easy, liquid art is even easier. Start by the liquid art, it's in the bottle. It's a nano powder, okay? So there's no water in here. I don't charge for water. So we're gonna take that cap off just like that. We're gonna grab one cup of water and we're gonna add that to the pouch. And one cup of water will fit inside the pouch. It's really easy to do. If you spill a little, it's okay. It won't hurt anything. So, one complete cup of water goes into the pouch. Take your cap and put that back on. This is the hardest part of making liquid art. Seriously, the absolute hardest part is shaking it up. So you wanna shake liquid art, get it all completely dissolved inside of there. Remember, it's a nano powder. It's 100% water soluble. So it's gonna absorb that water and it's going to be actually smaller than the water molecule inside. So it's gonna be really, really great. Now you can take this if you're worried about the hydration point of it, leave that overnight. Come back to it the next day and you're ready to go. Liquid art will never go bad, guys. Absolutely never. It only gets better with age. So it doesn't matter if it's a nano powder, if it's mixed in the pouch, if it's mixed in your gallon, it doesn't matter. Liquid art will never go bad. So step one, add a cup of water. Step two, take the included dropper and a gallon of water. Now we make these jugs so if they're calibrated for liquid art, I recommend that you get one for two reasons. One, you can always see what you're doing. Two, they're really easy to use. And three, you can always use them for your liquid art. They also make great potable water containers, so if you're going camping, backpacking, anything like that, really, really great. So that's all you do. Add your dropper of liquid art inside of there. Put your cap back on. Again, hardest part here, guys, give it a little mix, okay? It should look like coffee. It should look like coffee. And all you're gonna do is take one cap full, calibrated cap. This'll do up to 12 inches per cap. So 12 inches of pot area per cap full, just like that. And then all you have to do is pour it on. Now watch how I did that, because our spouts are really unique. Grab it by the spout, don't pick it up and try and pour it. Grab it by the spout, just like that. You can meter it out really quick and easy, really slowly. If it's a big plant, add a couple of drops of liquid art. Now, one of the key things people ask all the time is what happens if you add a lot of liquid art? Well, you can add as much liquid art to your plant as you want, and it will not hurt your plant, okay? Liquid art is completely inert. It will not hurt your plant no matter how you do it. Even if you take the whole bottle of concentrate and start adding that to your plant, it's not gonna hurt your plant. Now, the great thing about it is liquid is for every single plant that you have. It doesn't matter if it's a Hoya, if it's a fern, if it's a fig tree, if it's a pine tree, your lawns, trees, shrubs. We have every single vitamin, mineral element, essential nutrient, folate, fulvic acid, and the full biocomplex in here. The number one question is NPK. Of course we have NPK in here, but how we deliver NPK is completely different from other fertilizers on the market. 
The reason why is because our NPK has been digested so that it can enter plants right away. So we don't have to have gigantic numbers for it to actually do the benefits for the plant. NPK is a critical set of three elements, but that's not the only three elements that we need. Liquider has everything, not just the three NPKs. So if you're looking for a great, great plant fertilizer for not only your indoor plants, outdoor plants, use it on your garden. Fantastic for vegetables. You've never had a really good tomato until so you've had a liquider tomato. And it's just as easy as making your cup of coffee. So if you can make a cup of coffee, you can make a bottle of liquid dirt. And I'm Corey with liquid dirt. I hope you've enjoyed this. Have a great cup of coffee, make some liquid dirt, make a plant happy. Grow great with liquid dirt. Thank you.